Hello and welcome to part B of lesson 8. In this lesson I asked you to modify this program here so that instead of calculating double somebody's age you would calculate triple their age. So I'm going to look at this line by line. I still ask how old are you and I still collect that as a variable called age. And I can still say you are and print that. Instead of creating a variable called double age I'm going to collect a variable called triple age. I could call it any old thing but it's worth using a variable that has a sensible name it will make your life a lot easier. So it's not going to equal age times 2 it's going to equal age times 3 because I'm tripling it. So here instead of writing double your age I'm going to write triple your age and of course I'm not going to um, try and print double age because that doesn't exist anymore it's called triple age in this. And there we go, it shows up on the Intelli wheel which lets me know that I got that right. So I'm going to run the program. How old are you? I'm 46 years old. There you go, you are 46, triple your age is 138. So my program works and if you have any problems watch this video through and see how you should have constructed this program yourself.